What's going on guys? Today I'm back to give you some more tech vitamins. Um, today's vitamins are going to give you a little bit of knowledge uh, about the new iPad 3's or the new iPad, whatever you want to call it, its resolution and comparing that to the iPad's 2 resolution. So um, I picked up the new iPad when it came out, I had some time uh, or you know, had some time to play with it and I have my girlfriend's iPad 2 right next to it. Right now they're both turned up to its brightest setting and you know I just want to show you really why the resolution of the retina display um, matters or why it's, you know why it's a big upgrade to what it was in iPad 2. Now, so the iPad 2 in terms of resolution only went up to um, 1024 by 768 pixels. Uh, the iPad 3 or the new iPad goes all the way up to 2048 pixels by 1536. So there's a lot of difference. Now, unfortunately on YouTube, you can't um, see that as well. And what I mean by that is, let's take a look at some 4K videos. Uh, for those of you who don't know, 4K videos are the 4,000 pixel resolution, uh, resolution wide. Uh, mainly, or the video is usually um, 4,096 by 2,048, I believe. But basically, it's four times as much as 1080p. So let's take a, a quick look at some of these and you know when you launch them let me see if I can do it both at the same time you're gonna see that there's not that much difference I mean the iPad 3 I have to give it is much much crisper and the contrast of the colors are much brighter um, so it's a little bit more defined but in terms of being able to display the actual 4k resolution it's just not gonna happen right now neither on the iPad 2 or the iPad 3 uh, the, the graphics card just doesn't have the support for it even though the resolution is higher on the iPad 3 or the new iPad compared to the iPad 2. But let's quickly take a look at these two videos. And let me expand it. Well, looking at these two uh, different clips, you can see how much more vibrant the colors are on the iPad 3, especially the greens and the grass. Um, it just you know really stands out. The high, uh, much the contrast is much better between the colors. The definition is much better. So I think you can really see it in, in these clips. And uh, take a note of this sky as well is just much more clear on the iPad 3 which is on the right than on the iPad 2. And here zooming in a little bit you can again see the more vibrant colors that I'm talking about. I mean it's just you know the picture is incredible on the iPad 3 I do have to say. And there we go, there's timelapse.net. Um, check them out, guys. There's a bunch of very, very cool um, 4K resolution videos on their website. So, But I do want to show you one app that I've been able to find that really shows the difference between the two resolutions on, I on iPad 3 versus iPad 2, where you can really appreciate it and see how much difference there is. Um, and that is going to be my TeamViewer app. So I'm going to basically launch a TeamViewer app and log into my computer um, and my laptop that I have also have in front of me um, is displaying 1920 by 1080 p So it's also a 1080p resolution but we're going to see how they both look on the iPad. So let me uh, go ahead and do that real quick. Alright so I have both of the iPads um, logged in through TeamViewer to my laptop and on both of them I'm running the full screen mode at, 10, uh, at 1080p and I'm uh, logged into YouTube and displaying a quick video so uh, I'm not trying to show you what the video looks like because just simply through TeamViewer any video that's coming across 
uh, through the internet is not going to look anywhere near close to uh, as good as if you were watching it on the actual screen that it's pulling from. But I just want to show you the comparison, and I'm going to have to zoom in here real quick, of how much crisper the icons, especially on, on Windows, look through TeamViewer. So let me see if I can zoom in on these right here. That's probably where you see the most difference. So I can focus right there and I hope this comes out across pretty well tell me what you think so this is the uh, iPad 3 and right here is gonna be the iPad 2 let me do a one more example of uh, actually bringing up an image Move the camera up a little bit. And I'm going to pull up an image on my computer over here. There we go. So, again, zooming in on this one. And the camera itself has trouble focusing, but this is pretty decent so take a look at that and that's iPad 3 and this is iPad 2 so hopefully this comes across but um you know the, the retina display is definitely pretty damn awesome on the iPad 3 um, everything is just so much crisper clearer it's faster um, you know, other than that, there's really not that much difference between the two iPads. I mean, I can just quickly tell you, even without doing a review, that, you know, the iPad 3 pretty much has a better camera, front and back. Is It has a better processor and is really uh, only mainly for the better, the crisper retina display. So it's really the GPU that's much faster um, to display the resolution in terms of the smoothness of applications, uh, you know, going back and forth in the processing of applications is probably the same. Uh, the next uh, upgrade, obviously, is the, is the display. Um, let's see, am I missing anything else? And if anything, the iPad 3 is uh, 0 0.09 millimeters thicker. Um, it gets much hotter because of the display and the faster chip. So, um, you know, because of the little millimeter difference, be careful with some. Uh, iPad 2 cases, especially the ones that have a very snug fit, uh, you may have problems with those. Uh, trying to fit them over iPad 3, um, and am I missing anything? The last, yeah, the last difference is that uh, if you get the iPad 3 through Verizon, you can now have a 4G antenna in it, so you can get the uh, get on the 4G network. So that's pretty much it. I hope that some of this resolution came across. So let me know what you guys think. Uh, if you were even able to see the minute difference through my HD camera hopefully turns out pretty well on YouTube uh, but leave comments subscribe and I'll see you guys next time with another video peace